everyone, I'm Nicole Henderson, Content Director of IT Pro Today, and this is the Weekly Update. It's the show where I talk through the week's top tech headlines and why they matter to IT pros like you. If last week was defined by tech earnings, this week is all about artificial intelligence. We had several news items on IT Pro Today discussing AI investment, development, and some challenges that enterprises are running into when they're looking at AI in their own operations. This week, our reporter Terry Coles looked at the state of artificial intelligence. China and United States are still strongest in terms of AI development, but Europe is quickly catching up. There's also some issues that continue around diversity. There are not enough diverse voices training artificial intelligence, and it's extremely problematic. To read more about why and to learn more about what's going on with artificial intelligence overall, take a look at the article that I'll link down below. In a separate report, Tractica analysts looked at some of the challenges enterprises are facing when it comes to bringing AI into their operational processes. Integration, customization, maintenance and support are all areas where enterprises are struggling when it comes to AI. To read more of the analysis, and other reports by Tractica, check out our website. IBM and Microsoft didn't want to be left out of the AI fund this week. IBM is investing $2 billion in an AI research hub in Albany, New York. Microsoft announced this week its investment in Databricks. It's a company that provides tools that use artificial intelligence to surface meaningful data from companies' databases. That's it for this week, but I expect some more AI news to follow this coming week when I'm in San Francisco for IBM Think. If you'll be there, be sure to say hi. I look forward to meeting you. Thanks again for joining us, and I'll see you next time.